Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome back to another episode of Subnautica. So, last episode we did a little bit of work here. We got uh, somewhat of a base going on here. I was, uh, was messing around in the scanner room here. Uh, I didn't actually realize you could uh, pilot the cameras around. I was looking at this, and it's like, well, what's all this about? And I didn't realize that the cameras are actually mounted to the side of the scanner room. And you can actually pilot them around. This one is still mounted, staring at the Aurora. And we're going to leave that there. Uh, I was looking around, I guess, looking for wrecks, and I'm guessing these are the, the big wrecks, right? Uh, this is apparently the range. If you go out too far out of the range, then it starts getting a little distorted. Uh, I got a camera all the way out here, and it looks like, uh, as far as what shows up in the list, maybe it's what just happens to be in the area at the time. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, but one, thing is, one of the things I gotta do is I gotta look at getting some power. I never actually checked out this, uh, bioreactor bio so let's go ahead and build it I actually went and made the, the wiring kit I gotta go and get the lubricant so let's go upstairs grab the lubricant which should be not in there there it is I made it just because those creep vines are so goddamn big uh, I got so much silicone uh, silicone too so I don't really need it uh, let's actually just put it downstairs here all right so we'll put this oh this is big needs its own room apparently all right uh, let's find a room for it sure we'll put it in here why not now what does this actually use for fuel Uh, this is so funny sometimes. Okay, so what does this actually use? Oh, here we go. Alright, so what does it use for fuel? It uses organics. Uh, let's see what I have in here. Let's try that. Not. Is that going? It does. Doesn't give me any status of what it's doing, though. All right, well, now I found a use for those things. I actually have a couple of them in here, and I actually grow in a couple, too. So we'll see how that does for fuel. Let's actually go outside and grab a couple more of those things. Uh, where is my knife? I do not have my knife. I must have put it away somewhere. Not in there. It's not in there, either. I had it in here somewhere. I must have put it downstairs. Should be no problem. While we're here, let's listen to this. May it be recorded. This, is call. this is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission. Where did my knife go? I must have thrown it somewhere. Uh, yeah, I did actually see LifePod 6 somewhere when I was exploring earlier. Uh, in case you're wondering, I'm actually slightly pre-recorded right now. Uh, anyway, uh, let's see. Did I put it in here somehow? I must have lost my knife. Hmm. Good thing they're cheap to make. Uh, let's see. Let's get over here. And it's not in there. Unless I left it in the escape pod. Let me see if I can find that knife. I must have dropped it somewhere when I was making room for something. I have no idea. But what am I do? Because this is going to be my fuel source by the looks of it. I'm going to plant a couple more of those in there. And... Is there actually a way to get rid of these? I don't think so. No, apparently not. I'll take one more for the road. 
Okay, so now all I have to do is just make sure I keep fuel in this thing. I don't know how long it's going to last. Oh, there we go. Uh, charge of 210. So is this just like a battery? I guess so. No upgrades I can put in there. Oh, we can take that too. Interesting. Okay, well, let's uh, let's go hop in the sea once. Let's go do a little bit of exploring. Uh, let's see. So we're gonna go check out Light Pod Six first. Uh, there are a few wrecks in the area. We're gonna go investigate because I haven't had a laser cutter since. All right, so let's see where this thing is. Uh, life pod six. Where are you, life pod six? Are you serious? Can I not see it anywhere? Or is it just not showing up now? There. Oh no, that's it's camera one. Hmm. Let me uh, check something here. Beacons. Life pod. It's not showing life pod six. Yeah. Hmm. I think it was over this way, anyways. Let's go check it out. I know there are a few wrecks. Yeah, it probably doesn't show up because it's probably in the area already. But I do believe there was something down here we should go check out. There was a wreckage. Those things are a lot louder than they need to be. And I'm not sure, but I think I've been seeing warpers around. Every once in a while I'll see like this. This purple sort of splash, or almost like a bubble. But here we are. Let's see, we gotta find out where we cut this thing open. Right, let's go inside, take a look. Uh, I do not. Do not have a flashlight because my sea glide is dead. Uh, let's see here, laser cutter. Where is that thing? Oh, would you be quiet? Oh, that one doesn't get cut. I have been in here already. What is that? Um, yoga wave fragment. Uh, nothing in here I really need. I don't think I need this thing out. What is in here? Hello. Uh, ooh, scannable. Now to take that. Take the bench. Take the plant pot. And I gotta keep an eye on it. And my oxygen. Uh, anything else in here I can scan? No. Now we cut. <laughs> Come on. Can I, can't you cut a little quicker? And I am gonna run out of oxygen here. Okay. I gotta go grab some air. Uh, where's the sea moth? Over here. And take a quick breath, and back in we go. Probably could have gone the other way, but whatever. Okay. What do we have in here? Propulsion cannon fragment. Nice. Uh, 
Okay, I already got that, so I don't need any more. I don't need any more of that. I'm going to stay away from that. There's nothing. Is there anything worth risking my life for down here? Well, I'm going to say no. Okay, that was a close one. Oh, 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 what's this? Lightweight, high capacity tank. Cool. Anything else? No. Alright, let's get out of here. Off to the next wreck. Nothing else to cut open, nothing else to explore. Uh, don't know. I'll bring this sea moth around the other side and we'll have a look. Maybe there's any more items to scan. Some new things to build. Another excuse to find titanium. Yeah, that's where we just were. Oh, what's down here? I don't think there's anything down there. Oh, nothing. You mind? It's weird that life pot six wasn't showing up. Well, I do know it's a kilometer away, so I can't be that far. Uh, let's see, how far are we from there? A little ways. Let's just head down here quickly, see if we can find anything of interest. Not really. I'm more worried about making my way to the Aurora today, if anything. A poor fish bouncing off the sea moth like that. And we have another transmission coming in. Yes, I am pretty sure those are our warpers. Go grab this transmission since we're so close anyways. Yeah. Almost 100% certain that those are warpers and I do have to be careful because if I am infected then yeah then I could be in some problems it's weird like it's like it gets it goes light and then dark and then light and then dark Mind you, that one moon is pretty big, or pretty close. Whoops. I almost regret painting this thing red now. It seems like every fish in the ocean is trying to slam into this thing. But, what do we have here? Inactive already. Oh, we got it. nothing you need. Oh, wow, look at my, uh, that actually increased my capacity. Well, what do you know? Oh, it just happened to be... I was on my way there. Now, is that actually going to show up? Why is nothing actually showing up on my HUD? I have no idea. Well, let's go hop in, find out. Let's see what's going on. Good thing it's not hard. Good thing it's not hard to actually find the aurora. It's just weird that none of these beacons are showing up anymore. And it could be because I've already been there. But let us go. See what we can see. I think there was a few other wrecks along the way we could check out. Not a hundred percent sure. Okay, we're right here. Perfect. I 
That's weird, I'm not seeing these life pods anymore. I wonder if I got them turned off somehow. Like, where is the other life pods? Beacon manager. Eh. Okay, so it tells me roughly where it is. 150 no meters northwest. Oh, too bad I don't have a compass. Probably should get that upgrade for this thing. But anyways, let us explore. And hopefully not run into too many stalkers. But it would be nice to at least... Is, uh, oh, it's already packed. Would be nice to at least get the Cyclops today. And then over here. Are they actually fighting? They are, too. Uh, my money's on the Stalker. Well, I guess in this game I don't have money, but I can always... Always bet a couple of fish on the situation. That is nothing. Oh, be quiet. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Power, power cell. I will take it. Come here. Let me in. Wow, there's these black boxes everywhere. Well, as long as there's wreckage here for the stalker to play with, I should be fine. Another, what was that, battery cell or battery? Or power cell or battery. Oh, I'm getting batteries. Nice. I could actually use those. For things like the sea glide. And my repair tool. Okay, let's see what else we can find around here. I don't think there's going to be anything here. Wow, oh, there's so many things there I can get when I finally get the prawn suit. Right, dive, dive. Let's see what we can find down here. Not salt. <laughs> Never realize how big this ship really is. Okay. I gotta try to be a little more careful with this thing. the aurora doesn't collapse on me. And the shaking's kinda scaring me though. I'm not gonna look back. I'm not gonna look back. Just keep going. If you don't see it, it's not there. See? It's gone. It's gone. Wow, lots of titanium around here. What is that? Nothing. Yeah, I will eat shortly. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to be on this side. <laughs> oh my god. If I was actually in this tiny little tin can underneath this giant ship, I definitely would be needing a wetsuit. <laughs> Washing 
just wouldn't be enough. Uh, no. Oh, hello. Oh. Propulsion cannon. What else we got? Uh, do, do, do more wreckage. Nothing that's absolutely any use to me. Anything in here? More propulsion cannon stuff. And probably the same in here. Yep. If I was smart, I'd be trying to grab some of this quartz while I'm here. I'm always looking for quartz. Uh, is there actually land up here? Nope. Nothing I can stand on anyways. Wow. Hmm. This is just crazy. Holy jeez, man. Let's go. Let's go under. And let's get away from him. But the only thing I'm really worried about right now is those guys. Oh, jeez. I'm still under the aurora. Oh, God, I'm lost. There we go. I see some light. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, let's uh, move away from that. Ah, jeez. Ah, get me out. Ah, get me out. Get me out. What do I do? Oh, there goes my sea moth. Ah, jeez. That legitimately, legitimately scared me. So, I gotta... Um, Make my way back. I will meet you back there. Okay, I'm back. Barely. Not only did uh, I lose my sea moth, but as you can see, I'm almost dead. I was trying to change the battery of my sea glider. I got attacked. Oh my god. But yeah, I gotta get some food, get some meds, get some water. Get some supplies together, make it my sea moth, we'll get a compass, and I'll bring you back when I'm ready. So I'm out looking for some titanium, and I came across LifePod 6 here. So I might as well go ahead and do this, and what do I get? Something I've got on already. Oh, there's a PDA. Let's grab that. And then let's head up to the wall air quickly. Surface. The batteries in this, these things don't last long. Wow. Mind you, when you're running from a uh, reaper, you gotta do something, right? Alright, let's go back down to life pod 6 here. Go inside and see what we can find in there. Alright. Yeah. Oh, another PDA. What's this? Okay. Anything else? Lead. Take the lead. Uh, flares, don't need the flares. Okay. Now what else do I have? need? I have more than enough titanium. Alright, I shall meet you back at the base, wherever it is. And here we are. So, let's go ahead and break this down. Now you're going to make an ingot, and I should have everything on me to make the sea moth again. Uh, one thing I will do is I want to find out where that compass was. And I'm guessing that's going to be over here. Let's see here. Sea moth modules. Oh, I'm going to have to make one of those again too. Oh, that is no good. No, 
thought there was a compass module. I remember getting that before. Unless that was for something else. Solar charger, perimeter defense, torpedo system. Uh, kind of useless now on that, but now that means I gotta make another titanium ingot. I do need one, two, three, four, five, six. I need more titanium. Alright, I'll be back. Okay, there is a titanium ingot again. So let's go ahead and make the depth module again. Uh, what else do I need for it? Glass. That's fine. Now I think that's all I need. I don't think I actually need any more glass of sea moth. We're gonna find out. Makes me wonder how much titanium you can actually get before it stops spawning. If it even does stop spawning. Okay, that was kind of messed up. Uh, what am I missing? Oh yes, the power cell. And glass, one glass. Oosh. All right. Let us go, let us go, let us go. I was gonna say that, it's a weird color thing, but I realized it's, it's a shadow. All right, up we go, and we go over here. And I got quartz in here. No, I don't. So that means it needs a quartz too, do I? No. Apparently so. So, yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, let's go get my sea moth back. First, let's see what this says. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's... Well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Yeah, Sunbeam will be out soon. Can't wait to see that happen. Alright, so that's going to be the landing site over there. Oh, there's that there. So yeah, we'll definitely have to keep an eye out for that. Now, that'll probably be next episode, looking at the countdown there. We're probably going to be ending this one here soon, be just because of the fact of the Reaper-related incident. Oh, I need the power cell. Oh, damn it. Alright, back we go. And the power cell was... Oh, what was it? A wiring kit and two dead batteries? Uh, I think so. Let's just see here quickly. I need... Uh, down here... Power cell. Two dead batteries and silicone rubber. So the batteries I have on me... are not all dead. So put that one in there. That one, these two are dead. Okay. And I'm going to take one of those. I said take one of those. And we can make that. And I should have the lid on me. Yes. Alright. Off we go, making another seam off. See? I told you I should have made spares. I'm definitely going to have to start making some more eventually. Can I actually climb you? Oh, that's funny. There we go, there's my sea moth. Don't drop it. Hey, can you uh, change it back to the color I had too? And I just realized I gotta make my storage modules again too. Kinda sucks. Alright, uh, access. Upgrades, where are my upgrades? There we go. Alright, depth module. Nope. Uh, why is this not going in? Uh, 
Okay. Didn't want to work. Alright, back to the moon pool. And then we gotta make a couple of storage upgrades. So, ouch. <laughs> I always do that. Now, what do I need for these things besides titanium? Lithium. So, I need three titanium, which I have, and lithium, which I don't have, I don't think. Uh, let's find out. Uh, yes, over here. Right, nothing up my sleeve. Nothing there. No lithium. Hmm. Okay, well, it's not the end of the world. It's just a storage upgrade. Let's do a quick look on the uh, look on ye old scanner. See if it shows this lithium. No, it doesn't. Does not show us lithium. That is fine. Anyway. What was that clean? I have no idea. Anyway, let's go back and make the Red Baron 2. Or name the Red Baron 2. Uh, so what a shame, what a shame, what a shame. Okay, so base color. We are going with red again. I'm going to go like that. Yeah, let's keep it a bright red this time. Maybe we'll actually scare off the Reapers for a change. And do nice light blue inside probably. Uh, the stripe will have green. Actually, let's have that the other way around. Uh, the interior will be green. I should go for the nice dark green on that one. And then the name will just have white. And this will be Red Sea Baron 2. Nope. I hope I take caps lock off. Red C Baron. And I've re reached the limit. Alright. Well then. We'll do that then. How's that? Done. Alright, there we go. Red Sea Baron 2. That's actually. Let's actually make that name black. Alright. Well, we're, I think we're going to end up calling the episode here. Uh, i got to, again, take care of my vitals and usual stuff. Might as well eat those while I'm at it. And go from there. And I guess next episode we'll continue our ever never ending hunt for the Cyclops. But anyways, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave me a like and I'll see you in the next one. Later.